Radio check 27. Radio check 27. Cheetah to shore. Good land. Over. So we're gonna go hunt for some fish, and it's a beautiful day. There were no shrimps. No shrimps in the live well, which makes it a little more challenging, but it can also be to our advantage because we're not gonna be reliant upon. We're bait. naked and afraid. We're naked and afraid. Ah! Is that your naked and afraid face? Well, you ready to do this? Yes. I think the cheetah wants to run. Go, cheetah, go. Alright, you ready? Yes. One, two, three. Go, cheetah, go! go! <laughs> catch bait you follow the birds you see them and you know you're in a good spot what trying to do is read the water to where the bait are and on a day like today it's really easy because you can see ripples on the top of the water and that's where the fish are There's no fish there. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get us some bait? I got us some bait. <laughs> I had to throw the net like 18 times. I can't believe you caught that with a net. Oh, look at his lips. Let's say he's got some lipstick. Ooh, he's stinky. <laughs> Mullet, baby. Let me see. Smile. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Mullet. We'll even preserve his head. Why? Because uh, we can use that for bait. We want to take a look at. Oh my God! That's the innards. We're just gonna send that back into the water, and that'll feed a whole school of fish. Be good for them. Wow! It only took us until 11:30 to find bait. How's that feel? Be fishing with chunked up dead fish. I don't know. I'm just looking at you and you have blood all over your face. Kind of disturbed, not going to lie. Right on. First cast. If it's a catfish, I'm quitting. It is! Son you of a bitch! You can't quit. <laughs> it's the first fish. <laughs> you still have your bait, so here, bring it over here. Stupid catfish. Yeah. That's shark candy right there. Katie. You're the worst. <laughs> Who did? If that <laughs> I don't know how to use a fishing rod. If that head flies off that hook and smacks you in the face when you cast, I don't know what I'm gonna do. You're gonna laugh. Oh yeah, baby. Four or five. 
I'm guessing stingray. <laughs> Black tip shark. I'm guessing Dory. Dory, a blue tango, four feet long. Goodness. I don't think I have my shark tagging kit with me. Oh, boo. fish. No. I'm already slightly traumatized. I'm saying five to six feet maybe this fish. What? Oh my gosh. This is so exciting. Oh, fuck. Remember when you were like, do you want to take it? <laughs> <laughs> I'd be a, in the water. I caught a 300 pound hammerhead here one time. What? And uh, I had bruises all over my legs from it, from the rod sticking in. Yeah, like this. I bet. You need one of those like. Belts. I have one. The belts, the fighting belt. Yeah. I, have one. I just don't keep it on the boat. I probably should. Oh yeah, I can see her. Oh my God! Get over here. The nurse oh shark. Oh my God! That's huge. That's a huge nurse. Five, six feet, that's what happens, right? That is a big nervous shark. Oh my gosh! <laughs> wow! So she was trying to pull down because they like to sit on the bottom, you know? Right. longer you keep sharks on the hook, the more, um, they, they need to move, you know, sharks right. need to move to keep alive. And... I mean, what would you do? Just cut the line or? Yeah, I try to get the leader out of her mouth, you know, but he's huge. That's a big Are you shark. scared? No, no. I I'm would be. I'm not scared. I just fight this fish to bring her closer I risk you know that it's the longer I have to keep her on the hook you know and I don't want to I don't want to like like totally fight her for too long she's probably 200 pounds what, what can a, I do there's a, a set of pliers right there She's beautiful. She does not like the boat. Okay, set of pliers where? Right here. Come on, Mama. God, is she strong. It is. All right, give me those pliers, baby. All right, adios, darling. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, that's the best I could do. I don't want to fight her too long, you know, and hurt her and keep her in the on the hook because all the shark hooks and the rigs that I use are 100% steel and they will rust out, so she'll be fine. But I didn't want to leave the the braid in her and the and the other uh, the leader, but. When the when the hook rusts and the the um, the metal leader rusts away, all that will fall out of her mouth. So super cool. That awesome, was really babe. Cool, right? Awesome. Yeah, I love that. That was super fun. Sharks are an important part of our ecosystem, so I really do think that it's important that we maintain their their population. We don't kill them. We don't eat them. We respect them. No shark fin soup. No shark fin soup. That's really bad. Right now you're at 9.7 feet. The cheetah can do about two feet, two and a half feet okay. safely. You can't get her up on plane in anything less than three and a half feet. So that flat over there, we're going to want to try to avoid it. So we're going to want to go around it. Right away, boats to the right or boats to the left? 
So the way it works is not so much about where you are, but how big you are and what kind of vessel you are. So the bigger the vessel, the more right of way you have because they have less ability to move. Nice. Good job. Say again. It's further north. This is Caxambus. Yeah. Got two wind generators on the top. So cool. Raised by barbarians. He's probably from New York. This big Marco Pass? No. That's what I thought. Adios. Okay, bye. Spot. Oh yeah, I was gonna keep the shell, but yeah. somebody's in there. He's living in there. That's it's crazy. He's like perfectly, like all in all the little nooks and crannies. So what would this be considered? Is this a mollusk? Yeah. Is this a bivalve? I don't know. You're the one with a master's degree. Yeah. In mental health counseling oh that you talk to him about how he feels i see okay that makes sense don't touch it don't they like sting no they don't no oh it's really hard mm -hmm. Ooh, he's like pointing out ah. moving ah. that would hurt if you stepped on it though. it would hurt if you stepped on it yes Ooh. he's like Hey man, uh, put me back in the water, dude. All right. The touch pool. Hands, yeah. hands. How cool ooh, is that, right? Ooh. Is that like a little beak? That's his mouth. <gasps> That's where he eats. So how does he get the food like? I think the tentacle things, I think these help aid in that. fun is that though? Put him back. Yeah, that's a manatee now. Look at their noses! Oh my god! Stop! Looks like bona noses. Yeah, they're like they're like dogs. Oh my god! There they are! That is a monster manatee, too. Really liked it? Yes! Like, I'm so lucky that I get to live here and experience this. Like, that's amazing. People pay, like, thousands of dollars to come and, like, vacation here and we live here. And that's amazing. Super tight squeeze, but you know how I like it. I like it tight.
<laughs> well done, babe. <laughs>